So I do want to thank Sharon, who told me about her knot. Where are you? She didn't tell me right away. She started doing these little things with me that felt good, and then told me a little more, and a little more. She brought me right, right in. And um, I, uh, I have a practice that um, began transforming in the, the year 2007 from a highly successful 38-year bodywork practice, of which I'm very proud, and um, the skills I developed there prepared me very well to benefit from this experience. Uh, last August, I, um, fortunately for myself and my, th at that time, three-year-old niece, I visited, uh, met her for the first time, and discovered that she was a really unhappy little baby, and I uh, looked at her move, and she only arched, her body kind of lopped over to the left side, her arch uh, fell. Um, when I touched her sternum, I, I discovered, and this was after what most people would consider a perfectly normal birth, um, her sternum was tipped up at about a 90 degree angle from where I expected it to be. So as I contacted her sternum, she and I were looking at one another. And first of all, her, it was almost her sternum only needed to be acknowledged that it existed. It was so quick to move back. It just slipped right into its normal position. Um, but the look between me and Haley, I will never forget. She um, became peaceful and I could swear, grateful. So that was a one life <laughs> of many changed. Um, and not, I appreciate you. It's almost a practice of mine. Because appreciating you, it expands my imagination to think about what you have done. It enlarges my concept of what a person can do. So thank you. Um, also, I, I believe that you are sending a shot of intelligence through humanity and changing the course of our evolution. And Marcy, by communicating with your meticulous attention, your awareness to how students learn, and your constant refinement, you are also changing people who change people who change people. And, and me. How have I? What's happened? Um, it can all be summed up as having more access to myself and my passion for life. My desire for helping people, always a part of me, now lives in a bolder, more capable person. I have more challenges. My cl clear awareness of what I want to do and readiness to take advantage of opportunities mean I am taking on bigger responsibilities. And I need to figure out more, faster, to make my actions successful. I am truly more one with myself, with my pelvis engaged, my limbs freer and longer, and back stronger. I am more ready to go places, literally and figuratively. Having a stronger will blossom and grow depends upon a growing level of organization within myself. Life itself shifts to a higher level where dreams become material. Never before have I been more aware of making so many mistakes, being undaunted by them, or nearly so, writing them if possible, and feeling like I am in discovery, service, excitement, and happiness.